Hello Discord users, today I'll be showing you how you can set up an application bot for your Discord server. So first thing you'll want to do is create a channel. If you haven't already, or if you have a channel with the required permissions, you can just duplicate it as I'm doing over here. Once you've created the channel, go into the channel settings, give it a cool name and add a description. And make sure to save changes before you exit out of your settings menu. Now you want to go to your web browser and search AppyBot and go to the first link. Now here you will see the dashboard, click on get started and you'll have to log into your discord account. Now if you have two factor authentication enabled, you may have to enter a code. If not, it should take you to this page. Click on authorize and click on invite. Now it's going to ask you for administrator permissions, so don't freak out, it requires these permissions and the bot is reliable and safe to use, so it shouldn't mess your server up. And authorize, uh, select your server and click on authorize. And complete the capture. Once you've done that, go into discord, go into appies about me and click on the dashboard link. It should redirect you to this page, select your server and click configure. Click on applications, type in your application name and click on new application. Now select your application and here you can configure the settings. Now there are some really basic settings here and it varies from server to server. So you got to read through this and um, do it as per your server's requirements. The basic settings are you can enable only certain rules to apply for your staff applications or whatever you're setting up your applications for. You can also set up denied rules that are not allowed to interact with the appy bot. And you can also set up ping rules. So when people apply for staff or for any other uh, position in your server, uh, those rules will be pinged and the staff can interact with them in a separate thread. Once you've done that, you can enter your questions. Now it gives you a few, uh, you know, weird questions. You can just clear them out and add your own questions. Uh, I've personally selected some pretty handy questions here, which you can use if you're going to set it up for staff applications. You can also add multiple choice questions as I've demonstrated here. Just click on the button next to new question which says add multiple choice question. You can also customize the options that you want. Now once you're done with setting up your questions, click on save changes, go back to your discord server, uh, then go to your discord server settings menu, go to the rules section and make sure to drag your appies role uh, all the way from the bottom 
to above your staff roles it should be above your moderator and your admin roles if you don't know how roles and their permissions work then make sure you see a video on that i have a video on that uh, so i'll link it down below and if you've done that you should be able to test it out in the in the respective channel you can type the command it is slash application and then the application's name uh, it's a pre-built command if you use slash commands already so it's easy and if you have the members role it will give you your application in the dms if not it should say that you don't have uh, the required roles to submit an application and um, that's how you set it up in your server so if you all found the video helpful make sure to leave a like and subscribe we are closing in on 100 subscribers and i'll see you all in the next video